much changed England. Certainly impressed on Friday night, and with changes once again, will they replicate that commanding display? Sent into that six-yard box, and Italy struggling to clear. That did not take England long again. A lot of Uba Moy, a special moment for her, and look at the celebration. Rarely gets the chance with England, but scores her first goal for England. And just like on Friday, the Lionesses wasting no time and showing their strength from corners. We said we wanted goals, we said we wanted a fast start, and we've got just that. So England have already scored from one corner. And Greenwood, it's over the head of Vubamoy that time, Giuliani punches, Hemp towards goal. And Hemp will claim it. Lauren Hemp will 100% claim that, but for me it's all in the delivery. Causes confusion in the middle, goalkeeper tries to claim it, makes a punch. It just ricochets away into the back of the net. And Lauren Hemp will definitely claim that as her goal. And Kelly. And again, the England players queuing up. I think Charles was closest to that. That ball didn't go out of play either. And we're hooking it back in there. And it's header. And once again, England breached that Italy defence. Three goals in 33 minutes for the Lionesses. And Lauren Hemp, two for her. It's a brilliant header by Lauren Hemp. She's not the tallest of players, but she's fantastic in the air. She times it well, she directs it. It's a brilliant delivery in to start with by Chloe Kelly. Lucy Bronze keeps that ball alive, and the number of bodies in the box there for England makes it difficult. Lauren Hemp just picks out that position in the middle of the 80-yard box and directs, loops that header over the top of Giuliani. Three minutes to be added on in this first half. Ball's been playing a lot, mostly. Passed around by those in white shirts. But Italy have had some moments, and Cantore's had a few of them as well. Patena, and they do score! Cambiag with a goal, and Italy, having been under so much pressure from England in this first half, do actually take a chance when it comes just before half-time. All over the top to James. Doesn't mind being in these sort of positions, Lauren James. What a pullback! What a goal from England. And Ella Toon not taking her long from the bench. Brilliant finish by Ella Toon, making that late run that we've seen from the midfielders. The ball from Alex Greenwood that starts it. It's a fantastic ball over the top for Lauren James. And when she gets into that position, there's no stopping her. The touch, the turn of pace, and the clip back. And Ella Toon finishes with ease, volleying it into that top corner, leaving Giuliani with absolutely no chance. Fantastic team goal there. And Carter doesn't emerge with the ball in that situation. Oh, a mistake from Italy. And Daly won't miss that. Well, as we always say with Rachel Daly, any sort of sniff, and she takes the chance. And England up to five, and free scoring again. Brilliant centre-forward play by Rachel Daly there. She's a clinical goal scorer, and if you give her that opportunity, she will put it in the back of the net. Our two commanding displays for England over this winter camp. Thrashing Austria and a big victory over Italy as well. Two matches in which Serena Wiegmann rotated and saw quality from pretty much every player who played. And in their second game, England win again and win big again by five goals to one.